Hello everyone, my name is Bethany and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a treble crochet, a treble crochet decrease and a treble crochet cluster. So a treble crochet is just basically a little bit taller than a double crochet. This is uh, US terms. And you use this if you're needing to build up something higher. So I use it for the, on the heel of my stocking because I need to get height in fewer rows. So I have this sample piece and we're going to start on the next row. And you're going to start with the chain three. You can chain four if you normally start a double crochet row with chain three, but I usually start a double crochet with a chain two. So I'm going to start with a chain three. So to start the stitch you're going to wrap the yarn twice. So you have those loops on your hook and then you're going to go down and start the stitch. So into the loop, yarn over. This has this puts four loops on your hook. Then you're going to yarn over and pull it through two. Yarn over and pull it through two more and then yarn over and pull it through the last two. So you can see that it the uh, the extra um loop at the beginning gives you an extra step at the end. So it's very similar to a double crochet. You're just working um, the last two loops again. So you're going to wrap twice down into the stitch, grab the yarn, four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull it through the first two, yarn over, pull it through the first two, yarn over, pull it through the first two. So it's a nice tall stitch. Okay, so when we're working the decrease, it's similar, but we're gonna leave the stitch on our hook and join the two trebles together. So you start with the first part of a treble, wrap twice, yarn over, then you have four loops on your hook, yarn over, pull it through two, yarn over, pull it through two, that leaves two loops on your hook, and then starting in the next stitch, you're gonna wrap twice, go into the next stitch, yarn over, pull it through the first two, pull it through the second two, and then you're going to yarn over and pull it through all three. And that creates the treble decrease because you worked two stitches here and they're joined with one stitch at the top. So we're going to try that treble decrease one more time. Wrap twice into the stitch, yarn over, pull it through two, yarn over, pull it through two, and then leave those two on your hook. Wrap twice and go into the next stitch. Grab the yarn. Now you're going to have five on your hook. Yarn over, pull it through two. Yarn over, pull it through the next two. And then yarn over and pull through all three. So we're decreasing down with the treble. And then the last technique I'm going to show you is the triple crochet cluster. A two stitch cluster. And I'm, I use this cluster on my stocking pattern. Um, it's a way to fill in the space. So the you can see that the spaces in between the stitches are pretty large. And so when I'm working the heel on the stocking, I don't like all those spaces. But, um, you know, I need the stitch count to stay the same, one stitch in each stitch. So a cluster is a, is a treble crochet decrease worked in one stitch. So you're going to start by wrapping twice. Go into the stitch, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and then you're going to start the next stitch in the same spot. So yarn over twice and then go down into the same stitch as the other one. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, then yarn over and pull through the last three. So it's the same as a triple crochet decrease except it's worked in the same stitch. So it's still one stitch, but it's filling in the space, as opposed to these down here that um, are quite holy. This one is filling in the space so it doesn't look so sparse and empty. So let me show you that one more time. Wrap twice into the stitch, yarn over, pull through two, pull through two, then leaving those two on your hook, you're going to start again by wrapping twice into the same stitch yarn over, pull through two, pull through two, and then pull through all three. 
So this is a treble crochet cluster, a two stitch cluster, and this is a treble crochet decrease. And this is a treble crochet. Thank you so much for watching.